MathCast, created on March 3rd, 2024. Intended audience, grade one. Content or learning objective. Analyze and describe embedded numbers using five groups and number bonds. Created by Faith Villanov. Vocab. Number bond. Five group. Digits and count on. Number bond. A number bond is the relationship between a number and the parts that make it. This diagram is an example of a number bond. Within the example of a number bond, this box here will have the total number in it. This box will have one part of the total number. And this box will have the other part of the total number. Five group. A five group is when you separate groups of five from the whole number. For example, let's take the number seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have one group of five and one group of two. Five plus two is seven. Digits. Digits are any number from zero to nine. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Count on. Count on is a strategy used to add numbers. For example, five plus two is seven. Five, six, seven. When you look at these bumps right here, you start with five, add two bumps, one, two, and you get seven because five plus one is six plus one is seven. When using a number bond chart, you put the total number in the biggest box on the top, or sometimes it'll be on the side over here or over here. And then you put one part of the total into this box and one part of the total into this box. Two plus three is five. So when you break that apart, you can break it into many different, um, many different ways. Two and three is one of them. Let's start with this example. We have five butterflies on top and one butterfly on bottom. When you count these butterflies out, we have one butterfly, two butterflies, three butterflies, four butterflies, five butterflies, plus one more butterfly, six butterflies. Because we have a total of six butterflies, the six will go in the biggest box, which is the total box. And the number of butterflies on top will go into one box and the number of butterflies on bottom will go into the other box. Next up, we have a domino. There are one, two, three, four, five dots on top and one, two, three, four, five dots on bottom. So we put five in this box and five in this box. And when we count them all together, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dots total in the entire domino. So five plus five will equal 10. Lastly, we have an example with circles. There are one, two, three, four, five on top. So we have one group of five on top and one, two, three on the bottom. 
So we have one group of three on the bottom. When you count those groups together, you do five plus three is equal to eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So one group of five plus one group of three equals a total of eight circles. Thanks for watching. My math class resources were Degree Works and the concept videos created by Faith Villeneuve.